you've become, uh, in my opinion, a terrific actor, and not just my opinion, Thank a lot you. of people's opinion. Uh, <laughs> Nebraska. I thought your performance, your, your acting performance in Nebraska was really nuanced, it was really terrific, and you do a great job on your own show, Last Man on Earth, and what's interesting to me is you didn't really have a lot of formal training, or you never thought of yourself as an actor before, you obviously were a funny guy, but you didn't Thank think of you. yourself as an actor, is that right? Well, I was a writer for a long time. I, you know, I, I yeah, I went to, I took a, a year of uh, acting at uh, Akalani's High School, Mr. Eggertson. Uh, but that was it, that, you know, until I went to the Groundlings in uh, 95 right. or something like that. Right, that's the, the same thing I did. I was a writer and then I got into, the, you know, did some work at the Groundlings and sort of felt like, okay, I can use my writer's mind here in a way to get in front of people. Yeah. But it's interesting, I never, I never pursued any kind of serious acting. Did you consider yourself when you were younger? Like, I'd be a good actor. Did you think that you could I, do it? No, I don't think so. I, 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 it, I always watched Saturday Night Live and loved it and always thought, oh, I would love to be on that show. Right. Um, and out of, I was a history major at college, so I didn't do any kind of acting, but then right after college, I decided like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can try this thing out. And uh, my, my buddy had heard me say that, and he was at the UCLA Film School, so this guy that he knew was looking for an actor for this uh, class he was taking at the television school there. And, and I said, well, well, I'm an actor. And, and he said, oh, okay, well, maybe you'll act in my thing. So, you know, this guy got sold a bill of goods, and right. this was my first thing that I ever got to do. It was this, uh, it was called Day of Execution, and I, w I played this older man, and I, you know, came, and I brought all my own stuff, and I put a bunch of chalk in my hair so it seemed gray, and I, it's the worst thing you've ever seen. And I just found the tape the other day. You found day. the tape, and this is you doing some, this is, you're not proud of this acting you did here. It's the worst acting, and, and for some reason, uh, like, it, it does not say anywhere in the script, act with a southern accent. <laughs> but like, I'm just this, this old man with a southern accent with a bunch of chalk or talcum powder in his hair. All right, I, we have this clip, I have to see it. Let's take a look at this. My first thing. First compelling scene. I, I gotta tell him. I gotta go to the police. No, why? Don't you understand? There is nothing to be done. I mean, don't you see? I, I can't live with myself, but I have to. Don't. Uh, you, you can't stop me. I'll, I'll go down there myself. I'll tell him the truth. I'll tell him all about you. Oh, oh man, don't you understand? It doesn't matter. Rodney is dead. I don't care. Uh, uh, you don't care. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to see even more great Conan clips. You may now return to your pirated movies and creepy Japanese pornography.